Hi guys, welcome to Trailer Park Cooking, a little spin-off series we're doing. Today we're making waffles, chicken and some lovely veg which I've made and boiled. Now I've just moved into Covid Studios which is our base operations and it's a little bit of a dump at the moment but decorating and I realised I haven't got a, collar, uh, a colander. So, without further ado, I'm going to show you how we adapt in trailer park cooking. Here's one I made earlier. So we need to drain this fluid from here into here. How do we do it, may I say? With our old friend, Mr Tinfoil. Very versatile this stuff. Used for anything. Once, I once cooked a burger. And a car battery with one of these, really, real survival stuff. Couldn't be done, told me how to do it, apparently. Anyway, tin foil, little knife to show you where we are. Improvise, adapt, and overcome. Drainage holes, look at that. See, just enough to let the, the water run out. Now we don't have to go dafty, yeah? We're not lunatics. There is some down the road, it's called Frizzerton, where we live. Full of lunatics. Not us though. Now watch. Just takes a bit longer, but we're patient here to trail the park up and we certainly are. Now look at that. In fact, that would make a beautiful vitamin tea, that. I'll try it later. There we go. All out. Just wait a bit, let it drain. Let's see what's happened here. The other pan's filled. But not to worry, we just let that drain. Take the lid off. I'm not making that tea, I was only joking. Take the lid off, back in. For round two. There we go. All water drained from veg. We could have done it the other way, like, but I just wanted to show you how to make colour. We could have done it that way. Maybe it'd been easier, but we wouldn't have got all the water out. This way, if you look, dry as a bone. All the water's out of there, near enough. Go up and throw it up to there. There we go. No water in that. Now look, no water in that. Now I'm going to sit down and eat some trailer park food. As you do. And have a glorious meal and work for the rest of the night. Thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe. And all the good stuff. In fact, I'm just going to cut back in. I'm going to show you my full meal. Come on, let's have a look. All ready now. Plate it up. Oh, honest to God. Now that is some good quality grub, that. You don't get this in, you don't get this in Egremont. I can tell you that right now. Look at that. Slam that. Right. Lay waffle. Lovely jubbly. Let's get my plate. There we go. Bit of veg in there. Lovely trailer park food that. Homegrown. Homegrown. Straight out the packet. Waffles. Bit of carbs, you see. Now this is perfect food, no, look at that. Anyone would love a bit of that. Simple, effective, but does the job. Keeps me healthy, carbs, protein, and a little bit of uh, a little bit of vegetables. 
Thanks for watching. It's been a pleasure. Tune in next time for a bit of trailer park cooking. Promise it'll be a more advanced meal than what we've got right now, but we're kind of we're kind of low on amenities at the moment. Get amongst it though. Trailer park cooking. Trailer you later. <laughs>